Let's see if we can fix the PRZ or the CPL on this part. I brought this part in from Inventor and a student has made it, but nowhere on it do I see the CPL. So basically it looks to me as if the CPL is buried somewhere inside the part. No big deal, we can adjust it and let's try to put it in this corner right here. To do that, stock it first, say auto stock, and we're gonna choose the create CPL. I tell my students to change the name to new so that we can find it easily. We want to move the origin with it and we're going to try to do it through three points. This seems to work 98% of the time. And I'm going to say OK. First point on the plane. So the way this works is that it asks where do you want to put it? The positive x-axis then the positive y-axis, then the same place you want to put it. And if you look at that again, that is a counterclockwise right triangle, those three points. So let's try it. There's the first point. The second point should be the positive end of the x. Third point should be the positive end of the y. And the fourth point should be right back where you want PRZ. Notice too the red box that shows up around it. If that red box doesn't show up, you may have missed the point and it'll come in a little bit crooked and you won't be able to find any features. Be patient and wait for that red box. You may have to zoom in to get it as well. Click on it and if your PRZ moves to that point with the green arrow pointing in the positive Y, the red arrow pointing in the positive X, and the blue arrow and the positive Z, you're all set.